These guys have got balls. Right, I'm here with Paul, um, who's doing a care home conversion here in Droitwich, Droitwich Spa, it's very posh, Droitwich Spa up near Worcester. Um, now they've just recently bought the building and um, we started working together mentoring and he's done a, uh, you know, uh, you know what, I've, can I say something about Paul here? These guys have got balls. Have you ever been on a property development course but still haven't got started on any of the theory that you've learned? I hear this all the time from my clients. Courses are great for teaching theory and strategy, but are not good for the practical realities of taking on a physical development. Managing construction teams, sourcing the site, navigating planning, covering the pre and post construction phases, all core elements of a successful build. This is where mentorships can add serious value. Find out how I help developers take real action by booking a mentorship taster call now for just £49. I've got balls. Like people tell me I've got big balls <laughs> when I do sites, I go out and do all this stuff. But you yeah. know what? These guys have put their absolute trust in me as your advisor. Yeah. And this is coming from the heart yeah. where, you know, you've seen what I do. You've you found me online, um, you found me on YouTube, you know, documenting my various commercial conversions and yeah. Terms, yeah. And you've gone in and you've gone in and you've, you've trusted me to advise you. So Absolutely. thank you for that. Oh, I appreciate I, that. I genuinely appreciate that. Um, that isn't an easy thing to do, but Hopefully, and so far, yep. touch wood, yep. um, you know, we're doing all right in this site. You know, this was a site they've recently bought um, for 1.2 million. Construction costs are in at about 800 grand. So the total cost is in just over 2 million, I think we're in at. Yep. And there'll be a little bit of finance costs on top of that as well. Yep. But GDV, we just had an interim valuation of the end product of 4.1 million. So about 2 million pounds gross profit in what will be about 18 months, yep. I think, since we yep. met. That's correct. Um, so that's not bad. Hopefully we're going to go on to do a few more few more deals together. Absolutely. Um, but, you know, what are your aspirations for the, for the future, Paul, after this site? We've got a great site here. You'll get all your money back out and some. Yep. You'll have an asset that's bringing you in 12 grand a month yep. of, of gross profit, pre-tax profit yes. from the rent yes. once, you've, once you've finished this conversion. Yes. What, what are the plans for the future? Are we up for another one? Absolutely. I mean, initially, when my brother-in-law and I started out, we were thinking, you know, maybe we uh, buy a you know, typical two bedroom house converted to maybe a five bed HMO. And then, and then we, we thought, well, you know, what strategy do we take? Obviously thought about commercial to residential shops and uppers, but then we had a, a mentor session with, with Nick. And um, next thing you know, the first session, we've ended up buying his care home. Oops. And, and it's, <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> spent your money quick. And, and I, know Nick, I, I know Nick said about, you know, thanks for trusting us. But I can honestly say what you see in the videos is what you get in real life. Um, and it's such a fun and enjoyable experience working with Nick. It's very um, sweet. It's very sweet, isn't it? Well, it, it is true, really. Um, Thank you. Um, and then, you know, so you know, we, we've, we're gaining the experience of doing this care home to residential conversion. So it makes sense. We use our experience and skills to repeat it again. So, that's what we're looking for next. Yeah, let's go and find another deal. And you know what's great in the market, Paul, is at the moment, there are loads of old care homes. Yeah. They're gonna cost more than it costs us to convert this back to residential mm -hmm. flats and co-living blocks and all the yeah. various strategies we're using here. We're using a hybrid strategy of flats, HMO, et cetera, et cetera. We won't give too yeah. much away on this video. Yeah. Um, but these old care homes are coming to the market because the CQC care home regulations yeah getting more and more and more onerous, yes. which means that the cost of conversion of just getting it back up to the DDA, disabled yep. compliance, CQC compliance, yep. is more than what it's probably costing us to convert to residential. It's crazy. So these things are coming back to the market. There are all these custom built, brand new care homes being built by yep. dedicated care home com companies yeah. on the edge of towns. And it's just knocking older properties out of the market. Absolutely. Um, so they're coming back on. And what a great way to recycle property in terms of yeah. the ethics. I know you talked to yeah. me early on about your business, about wanting to do an ethical business and, you know, not adding huge carbon footprint and, you know, all the things we try to do in our development is That's giving right. good quality homes yes. to an affordable price to a market that needs it most. Absolutely. And that's where we are in the marketplace. So, yeah, it makes you know, total sense. It's, it's, a, it's a very rewarding development experience, isn't it? Not totally. all developers are greedy, horrible people. Yeah. We like to recycle. We like to yeah. make money. Yeah. It's a drive. It's a business. Yeah. Absolutely. Providing a quality, affordable product is kind of, you know, it's a good feeling. Part of, well, I know both of our sort yeah. of core ethics, isn't it? Yeah, totally. Yeah. And I have to say, again, 
coming from the heart. I love working with you guys. I yeah, find it fun, you. enjoyable. I don't yeah. dread a Zoom call. Oh, I just gotta yeah. you know, get through this one and get paid. Yeah. Not like that at all. You know, now it's about doing things you enjoy, isn't it? And, um, Absolutely. This is good fun. I hope you feel the same. Yeah, totally on the same page. Good man. Look, it's yeah. a pleasure working with you. And you too. Um, let's get back to work. Okay, cheers. Sitting that one, yeah.